We start tonight with new information on gun violence again at a busy mall area. A security guard shot and killed while trying to stop a car burglary. Now, this happened near the University Park area in North Dallas at Preston Center West. This was on Friday afternoon. A search for a suspect, it continues. And our Jason Allen spoke with the family that shooting victim lived with. They'd been wondering where he was last night, why he didn't come home from work after his shift here, thinking maybe he decided to work a double shift, only to find out today that he did not make it home at all. Dallas police told us today the security guard shot and killed was 34-year-old Alberto Santiago. The woman he has rented a room from for several years in Cedar Hill, Hill told me that she called him Max, and he in turn often called her mom. He had been a licensed security guard in Texas for the last decade. In fact, that's how he met his best friend, who he stayed with. He was working here at Preston Center West yesterday afternoon when police say that he saw a man breaking into a car here in the parking lot and confronted him. And a fight broke out. And then the suspect, police say, shot Santiago and then drove away in a gold-colored car. We learned police did find that car. It was about 90 minutes after the shooting. And they found it about 12 miles from here, over in West Dallas, in the parking lot of a closed business. Meanwhile, paramedics took Santiago to a hospital, but he did not survive. So investigators, they have the car, but they are still looking for the man who is driving that vehicle. They are also still looking tonight for anyone with information who might help them track that suspect down. In Dallas, Jason Allen, CBS News, Texas. Okay.